ESPN's presentation of college football is brought to you by Priority Mail from the U.S. Postal Service. By Transamerica, the people in the pyramid are working for you. And by Bold You, Vineyard Wines, fall in love with BD. Welcome back to Legion Field in Birmingham, Alabama. The Iron Bowl just about set to get underway. And Marquis Cooper and Clifton Robinson are back deep. Wisniewski to kick it off, and we are underway from Birmingham. On the goal line, Cooper. That room. Across midfield and tackled at the 45-yard line. 54 yards up. Marcus Spencer, I beg your pardon. Counter tray. Gets by the first tackle. Going to take it inside the 35 and go to around the 34-yard line, which should be enough for the first down. As Marcus into this three tonight, where the Burks will be allowed to because of the ankle. We'll find out as the evening goes on. The reverse. Nope, they fake the reverse and go back to the fullback Evans. And he breaks the tackle and takes it inside the 15 to the 11-yard line. First and five. See the secondary creeping up. The pitch comes back to Carter. Blocker in front at the two, at the one. Did not get in. They'll say he's out of bounds at the one-foot line as Griffith... They go with Heath Evans. Over the top, touchdown, Auburn Tigers. Hi, too many times. Not in this opening series and, tonight. And give credit to Mark Keith Cooper because he started it all with the kick. It is third down, and the line to make is the 49 of Auburn. Zao sets in the pocket, goes long, and in the well overthrown. Vaughn is the man that he wanted and actually Vaughn was open and that ball flew on him. Cards, 32% on third down conversions this year. They roll the pocket, barely gets it away and he's got a man there and it's caught. That's Robinson. Miles, the freshman, got turned around. Should the Auburn or Alabama 35 and a half yard line goes to Cuff and he's going to be sacked. Moorhead. Bailey of course you would think would be the go-to guy here. Gross slips as he plants his foot. He goes to Bailey. Has it complete down at the 32 and that's going to be about six yards shy of the first down. Fernando pretty equal to his longest. It's a good pass. He's got the distance, and he's good. Paul Hogan, number 74, out over the football, second and 10, and there's a mix-up. Somebody went the wrong way. I think it was Zao, and now he's really going the wrong way as Courtney Rose comes in to make the tackle on him. The tailback, Sean Alexander, who uh, confused it. From the shotgun, Alexander, nice tackle at the 14 by Jason Gray. And boy, the Auburn Tigers simply put in spots. You don't really know how badly a player is hurt on the sideline. Good pass in the flat, got it to Bailey, and he's going to be bumped out of bounds by number 25. Your interstate rival, so Gabe Gross is off to a big start. He learned a lot also from his father. He was an all-conference performer at center at Auburn. Quick pass. Got it to Baylor. Tries to do a turnaround back onto the field of play. You can see Bryant trying to knock the... was the intended receiver. And as you could... 
Auburn has a return on. Good coverage spiral this time. Spiral is turning over all the way back to the 30-yard line as Robinson breaks a couple of tackles and he's loose again. Robinson all the way down to the 33-yard line and we talked about special teams off the top and again well, it kind of erases that error he made back in the first quarter of catching the ball at the three-yard line. This is Demontre Carter. Alabama strings him out, but he turns the corner, and then, wow, does he pay for it. That's Marcus Spencer, the sophomore. So it's second down at about three. Here's Carter again. He's stutter step. He's loose inside the 10. First and goal, Auburn from the six of Alabama. Short drop. Fade, corner of the end zone. Bailey, touchdown. Oh, what a catch. One hand. Catches for 49 yards and now the touchdown as Baronis with the extra point. He is good and it is right now the Alabama folks are a little bit more still. Well, the offense is standing still. This one's not going to make the end zone. From the four yard line, it's Bryant. Fernando. 35 and out to the 40 yard line. Now let's see if that good field position. Tremendous first half for him. Number 54. From the shotgun. Zao dumps it off and has it complete at the 40. Michael Vaughn makes the catch. In the SEC. Two of six for nine yards for Zao on the evening. With the play action, Zao dumps got a man wide open at the 22-yard line. That's Eric Locke. Tackled by Brad. Get feeling in this ball game. Ninth play of the drive for Alabama. They trail 17 to nothing. Trying to get back in it. Straight ahead. First man through Montoya Madden. Big opening inside the 15, and he's down close to the. They'll run it. Alexander. Nothing to the right. Cuts back to the left. Tries to bounce it outside, and he does at the five. And touchdown, Alabama. Trying to make it a 10-point ball game. And he does. And Auburn will work with Gross under center. Alabama showing blitz. Gross under pressure. Caught from behind. And he's going to be tackled. That's Jamie Carter who came across to drag him down. Now, so a loss of about a half yard. Zow lobs it. Alexander trying to break away from the tackle to pick up the first down. He'll be a yard and a half short. Third down and short. Alexander looks for a spot to run. Samuels out in front of him, and he not only has the first down, much more. Alexander shoved out of bounds by Larry Kasher, and let's see, he stepped out of bounds. Paid off for him. He actually uh, came in with a full tank is the way he put it to me. <laughs> Harvin Richard in the ball game, they pitched to him. He wants to throw it, and he does. Deep, looking for Jackson. Touchdown, Alabama. tries to cut it to a field goal lead and he does three minutes 15 to this play gross rolls the pocket zings it and that is overthrown Kendall Moorhead was the man who was really really loved to do is score again before they hit it at halftime they were down by 17 Zhao pumps once Goes right over the middle, wide open his hall. And Calvin Hall works for the sideline. Did he get out of bounds? He whistled it back into play. And he did get out of bounds. They yeah, that's, out of that was the play clock that started, not the game clock. You're right, man. Zip this pass. That's Jackson. Full ahead of steam over the middle. Jackson at the 10, down at the 5, at his first and goal, Alabama.
Pull back to the one-yard line is Madden. As they tried to cross it up, and they did, is Madden. A little football. Zhao on the sprint out. To the end zone, it is intercepted by Haven Field. And he had a wide open receiver in the end zone. Calvin Hall was so wide open at the back. Play action by Gross. Looking, got him open. That is Robinson, and the tackle is... Gross, and he just flipped the ball out to Carter. finally falls down at the 25. How much of an ad lib was that? You talk about a smart foot mean again. Third down. They need to take it to the 15 to keep this drive going. Gross is going to be tackled at the 29. That's Cornelius Griffin. Good pass. Plenty of distance. He is no good. He didn't hit that one well, Ron. Uh, four of nine, a third down conversion for Alabama. They need to take it to the 43 to keep this drive going. And Zhao is not going anywhere as he is sacked for the second time tonight. Back inside. The they missed two field goal attempts. 46 and 45 yards. Drills it. Intercepted. That's Spencer. Gross is the only man who can get in, and he will. Ron, a blitz player had a shot at him. Back to live action. Alexander loses the football. And Auburn has recovered at the five. Brad Ware. Third down at about 22. Here's Carter. Takes it off the left side for four, maybe five. Travis Smith again. Again, a safe call by Auburn and Jimbo Fish certain situations. And then try to call the best play you can call. Zhao delivers it, has it complete, and that's Bowens. A coaching, you must win the rivalry game. I mean, that, that's the most important ball game you've got all year. They take it to Alexander, then throw back over the middle. Alexander makes the catch. And he's loose in the secondary at the 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown. loses his head. ball club is going to have to be reckoned with this Auburn Tiger football team. That was Haven Fields who was being attended to on the sideline. Gross got it away. It's picked off. Merrill stepped right in front. And that's where you get you in so much trouble. Yeah, you try to make a play. Kenny Smith really with good pressure on game. The big step forward toward winning with a touchdown here. Sal has it complete to Hall, and Calvin Hall is going to be tackled just 17 points. Then Alabama has come back with 21 unanswered. Zhao looking for the end zone, gets cleared, swings it out to Alexander, and breaks one tackle. He's going to wind up with a gain of about six yards in the play. Trying to get to this, block this kick. He's got it. 36 yards. Take it to the 44-yard line to keep it going. 
pressure on Gross. Gets by one. And delivers a pass. And I'll tell you that with his drop by Embry. Meanwhile, Gross took a shot. as whack. Vaughn, the man in motion. Saw the blitz coming, and the pass is well overthrown. There was a collision. Nah, just good coverage. Yeah. Good coverage, incidental contact. Vaughn is the man who went to uh, spit it. If he can get up a good high one as he did back in the first half, he can shoot it a long way, and he does. This spiral turns over way, way back to the 18. Ball is fumbled, and... Alabama football. Second down. Alexander back into the boundary. He will score. Chris Samuels with the paving block. Norman, you have to have it. You go behind your best offensive lineman. And that's number 31 to 17 ball game. And he does. Flag at the line of surprise with Arkansas over Mississippi State. And the Bulldogs coming away with a huge win. Through the hands of Gross. And that one may have been taken away. And that, that Moorhead took it away from him. So this was history. This ball game. That should do it. Ten seconds. Down to nine. And the crowd will count it off for you. Alabama wins it 31 to 17.